Hello YouTube and welcome to another Blender Game Engine Python tutorial. Today I'm gonna teach you how to test for keyboard inputs in Blender Python. So the workflow is actually very simple and it's way easier than using those those um, logic bricks, yeah. So first thing we are gonna do is we're gonna import BGA. Then, yeah, BGA is, um, is known as module where all the Blender game engine runtime functions are stored. Then we are gonna define events is BGA.events. Logic is BGA.logic and keyboard is bj.keyboard this these are static variables wait no it's not bj it's logic however we can set this up easier those three lines can be converted into one line from bg import logic mn what this does is import the bga.logic module and bga.events module. This makes it shorter, easier to read actually, yeah. That's how we go. Now I'm gonna create a function. I'm gonna call it key down slash down. And we're gonna take in one argument called key and now we're gonna make a function which tests if the key is down or it is not and if it is down then we are gonna return true otherwise we are gonna return false this is actually easy and in as Python is easy to use and flexible you don't need many complex lines here just return key keyboard dot events key equals logic dot key x down slash input down slash active done we have key down function now how do we use it it's simple if key down events dot key name for example we or it can be left shift or anything else for example space and then we add postfix called key um yeah and now here under the if statement you can execute anything and it will be executed only if the key is down i'm going to apply force um for example as it is space it's gonna make it jump Now, if I run, hold down space, yeah, I can make it go up with just space. I can set it to use we. Now, when I press space, it doesn't move, but when I press wiki, it moves up. I'm gonna leave it wiki, and I'm gonna set it to move it forwards, actually, like this. Now, we can make another function, but if you want it to execute only if you just tap the key and when you hold it down it won't execute only anymore, just single frame, you can do it, you do def key hit, I'll call it hit, and take same argument, and we're going to return keyboard events key equals logic dot key x input just activated what this tests instead of being active it just tests if it was not active in previous frame but is active now and if those both statements are true then it returns true here and 
we're gonna make it an error if statement key hit if key hit event dot space key own dot apply force zero point zero thousand point no zero point zero thousand point zero I'll set this to false for now now when I hit it just like can see like just moves on. but I can keep tapping it and it will move but if I hold it it doesn't move anymore but if I hold it wiki it actually works all the time so what this does is it, you can check for example if if it is like uh, how fast can you hit the keyboard keys or something like that I don't know whatever so you can check it if the player hits it not holds it down like this this test if the key is being held down of course if you just tap it to act similarly like key hit but if you hold down this will still return true this function while if you use this function it will return true only if you have just heated it okay this is it for this time thank you for watching and I hope you find this useful if so don't forget to leave like and comment comment anyways if you have any opinion about this uh, if you didn't find it useful feel free to hit dislike um, but I hope you all enjoyed it so thank you for watching and have a nice day